Ah, my name is Bob and I'm a sweater. Hi, my name is Ed and I'm also a sweater. And what I mean by that is when I work out at the gym or otherwise exert myself, a small waterfall forms across my brow and my entire face gets dreadfully wet the whole time I'm exerting myself. So much so that I'm dabbing my face literally every 30 seconds with a towel to stay dry. As annoying as that is, I decided to invent out of old RC parts, the e-towel. This is a propeller driven uh, fan that I can clamp right to the elliptical or treadmill that I'm working on and it just blasts me with cool air. I'm going to say 20 miles an hour worth of nice fresh air. It keeps me perfectly dry and clean. Don't even need to take a towel to the gym anymore. All this is is a small 2200 kV motor with a 5x3 prop, a 10 amp ESC, a servo tester which acts as the sort of power control, and a LiPo battery. This is a 2200 milliamp hour battery. This uses about 800 milliamp hours uh, per hour of use, which is how long I run on the elliptical. And it's simple as clamping this uh, plastic squeeze clamp, which I got from Harbor Freight for about a dollar, right onto the bar and turning it on, which it sometimes does by itself. And so it turns and it can be turned up, higher or lower, depending on how hard I'm exerting myself. It gives a very focused, uh, intense column of air right at my face and neck, more so than a kind of an average fan. And it'll actually go up pretty darn fast. I haven't surprisingly gotten any remarks or been approached about this, even though hundreds of people go by me a week and see this happening. I don't know if they think I'm a freak or they're jealous of it or what. I only did ever have one small mishap where I had it clamped to the machine here and I'm working out and this uh, particular lady comes up. This is at my wife's gym, which is the fancy gym in town because they have really good childcare and I go to the kind of the Joe Sixpack gym down the street from my house. But I was at my wife's gym and this uh, particular lady came up, probably the wife of a plastic surgeon or a personal injury lawyer, if you catch my drift. And she came up to my machine, which is one of probably 100, and reached right under this into the cup holder looking for her car keys, which she thought she'd left there. And I thought, I was pretty sure she was going to slice all the tendons on the top of one of her hands and uh, sick her husband on me. But it turned out well. Nobody got hurt. Uh, otherwise, it's been pretty flawless. It's of course not perfectly safe because if you touch the prop, it's a problem.